So I'm standing in front of Curley School. It's June 5th, 2017, 25 years ago in 1992. They buried a time capsule here. It's gonna be open today and we're gonna see just what little treasures and mementos they left behind for us today. Let's take a look. Uh, uh, wow, welcome. Uh, so, 25 years ago, uh, this was placed here, and we've been curious for some time as to what is in it. So, today's the day, today's the day we killed it. It's uh, been 25 years and a month or two since it went in the ground. And if everything goes the way we think it should go, we're going to lift this off and we're going to discover what's in there. Now, before we do that, there are some people here who were right here 25 years ago and went in the ground. So, just curious, just curious, if you were a staff member, so a principal, a secretary, a teacher, if you were working at Curly at the time this went in, could you please put your hand up?
by many people.
Actually, doing my teaching practice here at that time. Yeah. Are you guys bearing another time? Yeah, by the end of the school year, we'll have another one. Same place. Same place, same board. And another 25 years? Another 25 years. Okay, yeah. so what are you putting in there? Um, kids have samples of their writing, uh, some of them have written letters to themselves. Um, you know, they, they're putting uh, things like Pokemon cards, the fidget spinners, right. where some of those things are going to be. The things that are actually emblematic of today. Of today, right. That's right. Yeah, we'll put some school things in there. And we're going we're to try and find some technology to put in there, too. Are you going to try and uh, turn on the Apple? Uh, Absolutely. The Apple? Yeah. Absolutely. Well, I can find a power cord for it. Okay, well, this is really good, and you have quite a good turnout, and the weather Well, that's great. Thank you for letting me show this. And, uh, too bad to travel. 
as what happens in a real world situation. But that that was really good. Thank you very much. Thanks for I won't keep you anymore. Appreciate it. Okay, thanks. Take care. So uh, from the background, you can see people looking at the scroll that came out. They're very engrossed in that scroll. I'm sure some of them actually might have their own material written on there or know the people who did. The time capsule uh, unveiling or the, the opening of the time capsule was a great success. The weather cooperated, there was lots of people, and from the cheers and the clapping, I know that people enjoyed this event. And uh, that's another thing that happened in Grand Forks. For what's up, GF.com. I'm Les Curly School. See you in 25 years. They're burying another one.